Hello and welcome back. We are so close guys. So this is floor 98. In this video today we're going to be doing floors 98 and 99 here in the Dark Tower in Prodigy Math. And that's going, we are three away from the top, three away from the boss battle. I am so excited. Um, be sure to like, be sure to subscribe. It only takes a couple of minutes. It's super helpful for me. It's also helpful for you because you get to know when I beat the Dark Tower. If I beat the Dark Tower. All right, let's go to our boss, our battle here. See the chance wheel for level 98 or for 98. All right, it's spinning around here. And it looks like we're losing 10 hearts. That hits pretty hard here. These battles are getting tougher and tougher. All right, so here we go. We have flame creators now. Let's go ahead and start out with a mythical attack. I think I'm okay with that chicken for right now. And let's see what we would like to do. I'm just going to go ahead and tsunami it. Let's see. Complete the addition, sent ad addition statements. All right, so we are adding up. Our last value is going to be 9. So we're looking for a way to add up to 9. Um, since 6 is our value, 7 is too large. It's addition. 9 is too large because it's addition. 8 is too large because it's addition. So it looks like we'll be adding up 2, 3 in some way, which would, since we have a 3 and a 3 here, 1 would be too low. So it would be these 3 plus these three, which one would work? Um, since this is 3.9, that's too high. So this side has to be 5.52. If there was like a two, then we could choose this val uh, th this this variable and that would work out. But So we have to figure out what adds up to 3.552. We just use process of elimination. Um, and here we are gonna be adding up to six. So this would add up to seven. 3.54 would add up to seven. So 3.147 is what we want to do. All right, let's see what Tsunami does here. And that should be powerful against Flame Creator, weak against the other two. And let's see what Flame Creator unleashes on us. 26. I think that's close enough that I can go ahead and have a chicken. Let's let's stop our battle for a chicken dinner. Oh, fantastic. Okay, falling start. Oh, I should have done the other one. That's all right. Uh, complete the subtraction statement. So we're doing the same process here. Um, 8 minus 3, that would equal to 5. 2 minus 4 would equal to 8. <laughs> 12 minus 4 if we regrouped and so that is going to work out if we change the 6 6 to a 15 15 minus 8 would be 7 4 minus 2 after regrouping would be 1 3 minus 2 15 we take the 14 14 minus 5 would be 9 so that is the correct subtraction sentence all right, 4166 here. One more hit for Flame Creator. Our mana is just about full, so I think I am gonna go ahead and switch it up here. And do a Supernova. I don't know what's waiting for me on floor 100, and I'm a little bit, little bit nervous here. All right, so our Thousands Place is gonna add up to six and so that means since this is an eight we're going to add up and over so this does this has a zero in the thousandth place eight plus three would give me an odd number seven eight plus seven that would be 15 eight plus eight is 16 so this plus this would equal to 9.206 the others are just logically incompatible with that first digit up we go, down we come. Goodbye, Flame Creator, and let's see who's jumping up. That was a critical hit. Fantastic. I'm glad we got one of those in. All right, it is River Creator creating a down portal boom right on top of our heads. All right, and I think we are going to go ahead and go with one more supernova and just wrap this one in a pretty little bag. All right, so we're doing subtracting, finding the missing value. So what minus 8 is going to equal 9? So this would be, have to be 18 here. 18, oh, 
no, so that would be, sorry, this would have to be a 7. 17 minus 8 equals 9. So our thousands place needs to be a 7. So we have two values that are 7. 5 is smaller than 7, so that would actually be a negative number. So it has to be 9.157. Woohoo! And this should wrap it up, I think. If not, maybe we'll get like one little attack in. And that looks like it's enough. See you later, creators. All right. Man, am I excited. This Star Tower has been a blast. I am just, yeah, I have been loving it. Getting a few more stars here. Riptide should be 85 uh, before we leave the Dark Tower. Got a Morph Marble for Miss Steel. Awesome. Let's head on up here. Floor 99. So next floor is our boss battle. I cannot wait. Chance wheel time. Let's see if the wheel's going to be kind. Okay, it's spinning around, it's spinning around, and 10% hearts. Okay, we can live with that. Lose 10% hearts here. Wizard battle. So we're back to fl uh, the flame neeks and all of that. Let's go ahead and just start out with some... Yeah, let's do Tsunami. I like Tsunami. Okay, so we're multiplying 6.364 times 0 0.3. And so, um, as you do this, your answer would have to have four values. So it wouldn't just have thousands, it would have a ten thousandth place. And as you do this, I'm just going to go ahead and work it out on my phone and our answer should be 1.9092 on the calculator function here. Your teacher may want you to work it out. Your parent may want you to work it out. Listen to them. They know you and they know you're learning. Um, so yeah. All right. I can't believe we switched to flame leaks for level 50 for 499. This is, this is kind of a Making me think that there's going to be just like seven or eight different waves of people coming out and attacking us. Um, Supernova here. I don't feel like 499 should be this easy. Okay, we're four, so we're multiplying here. And so for multiplication, we have one, two, three, four, five um, place, place values to the right of the decimal. And so we would have to do... 0.9 is out. So 0 0.32 is the one that we need to do. And so what we have to do is we have to figure out when we multiply 0 0.32, what is going to equal to 4. 7 times 2 equals 4, and 2 times 2 equals 4. So that is no help at all. So I think we have to do some work here. Okay. I'm not opposed to work, <laughs> but I like to make my life easier. I think it's, I'm going to click 0 0.832. Um, the 9 looks like it's a little too high of a value for me, but let's go ahead and see if I'm right. That's just kind of my gut instinct. Okay, so no, that is 0 0.832 is 0 0.26, so it should be 0 0.9. That's why you always want to work it out, even if you feel like you know something. And that is the correct answer right there. Let's cast our soul. Woohoo! So even though you use logic, if you're not 100% sure, go ahead and do the work, work it out, make sure that everything clicks. Okay, let's see if they just go away and this is a really easy floor for us. Or is there more people? No, we just won. Okay, cool. <laughs> that was a shock. That was a surprise. I was expecting for floor 99 to be just like, ah, but no, it wasn't at all. Okay, so 15 stars here. Now. I, this, this has just been an awesome battle. It's been a wonderful storyline. I've really enjoyed um, hearing the story of the Dark Tower. We are going to go up to the next floor in our next video. So we have finished up to 9499. So our next level is going to be floor 100, the final boss battle for the Dark Tower. I'm going to miss this. This has been a really, really cool uh, game mode. And I have just absolutely loved it. So in the comments below, let me know how you have enjoyed the Dark Tower. And um, yeah, anything else you want to share with me? Because it's, it's been a blast. I am going to miss this. 
Um, uh, but I'm excited to find out what's going to happen in the boss battle, okay? Be sure to like, be sure to subscribe, more good Prodigy math, Prodigy, old, old, old Prodigy, Prodigy English, and other games are going to be coming up, okay? Take care, keep on prodiging on, we'll see you next time guys, and wait! Bye-bye. <laughs>